alive. It isn't my big brother. Mr. Wonka, what's going to happen to the other kids? Augustus, Veruca. My dear boy, I promise you they'll be quite all right. When they leave here, they'll be completely restored to their normal, terrible old selves. But maybe they'll be a little bit wiser for the wear. Anyway, don't worry about them. Yeah, what do we do now, Mr. Wonka? You see, I wouldn't want to accidentally release the evil Von Creepsula from his comic book prison. Huh? Where all the other bad eggs go? Down the garbage chute. Oh, the garbage chute. <laughs> what, what does it lead to? To the furnace. <laughs> To furnace! <laughs> she be sizzled like a sausage. Well, not necessarily. She could be stuck just inside the tube. Inside the... Sure, what makes you think we need your help? Are you serious? What do you want? I'm here to announce that King Mufasa's on his way. So you'd better have a good excuse for missing the ceremony this morning. Oh, now, look, Zazu, you've made me lose my lunch. Ha! You'll lose more than that when the king gets through with you. He's as mad as a hippo with a hernia. What about you, sir? You've been so kind in looking after the children. Uh, me, Mum? Well, I, I have to be moving along. The Lord Mayor's got a stopped up chimney. Chimney? How clever of you to know. Our drawing room chimney's in the most ghastly condition. Smokes incessantly. <laughs> Thank you so much. But... Besides, it'll amuse the children. Cheer up, my dear. This should be something of a celebration. I'm sorry, but there doesn't seem to be much to celebrate. I still haven't mastered that spell. Of course you have. You just need a little more practice, that's all. Do you really think so? No doubt about it. Meantime, there's nothing to liven the spirits like a little master juggling. There's going to be a lot of garbage today. Ah, Mr. Salt finally got what he wanted. What's that? Haruka went first. Mr. Wonka, they won't really be burned in the furnace, will they? Hmm. Well, I think that furnace is lit only every other day. So they have a good sporting chance, haven't they? Well, as far as brains go, I got the lion's share. But when it comes to brute strength... Well, uh, I didn't really want to trade all my comics. Forget it, Charlie. You don't need to get me Von Creepsula number one. I already have it. You do? I have to see it! Junior? Junior, where are you? Ooh, a chicken nugget. Don't touch that chicken nugget. Junior, where are you? Ugh, that's my last chicken nugget. Don't touch it. Junior, you're fat. What happened? I want a year supply of McDonald's, and I've been eating it every day for a month. Oh, okay, that makes sense. That's why I haven't seen you downstairs for a month. Uh-huh, so uh, can you please just toss that chicken nugget in my mouth? I'm not tossing that chicken nugget in your mouth. It's time for you to get ready for school. Just please, just toss it right here in my mouth. <sighs> Look, here. Uh, here, fatty. Oh, uh, hey, it didn't go in my mouth. Well, well, come on. It's time for you to get ready for school. Oh, can you at least order me a Happy Meal for school? No, no, I'm not ordering you a Happy Meal. It's come free. On. My apple pie, you bitch. Come on, fatty. I met Shaq at a basketball camp a while back when he was just about your age. Yeah, Mr. H was our counselor. Used to call him the big man. We've been tight ever since. Shaquille's in town on a publicity junket for the weekend, but he's volunteered to do a basketball mini camp while he's here. It's gonna be a big surprise for the kids. That's it! There's your problem! Disease-carrying mosquitoes! And they come from these disgusting swamps! The breeding ground for this blasted insect scourge! Drain those swamps, and your mosquito problems will be solved! We're finally here! The real thing! Where's Jamie and Adam gonna be here? With Buster having a career crisis... I wonder if Mike Rowe is hiring! Philip puts the throttle to the metal. The jump in volume is immense as the engines scream at full power. Time to hail our cat. Ouch! The force combined with an old runway is a recipe for rippage. Huge pieces of asphalt are being tossed aside like tissue paper in a tornado. That really blows. I'm really sorry, Bob, but Bibu had it coming. Being splashed with water is no fun. Hmm, you're right. We'll cut that from the act. In fact, I think I'll cut the whole act altogether. Really? Don't you think you can fix Bebo? I'm gonna retire, kids. 
Working with Bebo is just too exhausting. I bet he can suck the life right out of you. What'll happen to Bebo now? Observe! Taxi! Buster, are you ready? Hold on tight! You're gonna be fine! Get it on. Clear on two and three. Clear for takeoff power. Clear for takeoff power. Okay, coming up to power. Buster watches from the hot seat as the engines fire up to full throttle once again. It's now or never for the taxi. Will it flip or will this myth flop? Works every time. There we go. I now declare the Panama Canal to be open! Some more french fries and a cheeseburger on top! Jesus Christ, Junior. I mean, nice cans, but why aren't you wearing clothes? And also, what is this? Cheeseburger Mountain. Cheeseburger Mountain. Junior, just because you have a year supply of McDonald's doesn't mean you have to make Cheeseburger Mountain. Look, Cody, I'm the one with the year supply of food from McDonald's, so if I want to make Cheeseburger Mountain, I can make Cheeseburger Mountain. And the reason why I'm not wearing clothes is I spilled ketchup on my shirt and shorts, and I took them off, and the only thing I had to wear was this loincloth thing. Okay, fine, Junior, whatever. I just came over because I wanted to know what the teacher wanted earlier. Like, did he want to make a deal with you or something where you'd, like, do stuff for him to get an A? Because, I mean, if that's the case, I'll do it. I'll take one for the team. I don't mind. No, he just wanted me to eat more so I could get fatter. He wants me to be a sumo wrestler. A sumo wrestler? Yeah, he wants me to fight, like, one of his enemies as a sumo wrestler or something. What? Uh, oh, no, Junior. I it's not Wohe Big, is it? Who's Wohe Big? Wohe Big is the most dangerous sumo wrestler in the world. He's a 10-ton, 10-time champion. One time, he even killed a man by sitting on his face. What? Really? Yeah, I have the video, and I, I watch it, like, all the time. And I even save the timestamp for when it happens. Oh, well, I don't know who I'm fighting, but I don't think it's Wohe Big. But no, the teacher said if I beat the guy, he won't make me do your homework for the whole school year. Dope. Yeah, that's really cool, yeah. I think that's the teacher. Uh, go answer the door and then leave. But, all right. Yeah, well, I, I don't want you to distract me. I gotta eat and I gotta focus, Cody. I gotta focus. Okay. <laughs> all right, Tubby, I got you some lard. Lard? I mean McDonald's. Not fat enough. You need to drink this lard if you want to beat Wohe Big. I am fighting Wohe Big? Yeah, I think you got what it takes. You're fat, he's fat. You got to drink this lard if you want to get big. Okay, I'll drink it. When's the fight? Like next week? No, it's right now. So we got to go. You got to hurry up and drink this. Come on, let's go. You got to drink it, walk. Drink it, walk. Let's go. <laughs> 